Welcome back. If I send a message with lots of spaces, either at the beginning or at the end, so for example here, how are you? And then I add lots of spaces, as you can see, lots of spaces here, and I send, I am going to get, I don't, un I don't understand. Even though the how are you is already inside the array, is already inside the array of possible messages. So why is that? The reason is that the spaces count in this situation, the spaces count, and what's going to happen is that here, if we go to the if we go to the process message, it's going to filter the array, but it's no it's not going to find a match because the spaces count and it will return I don't understand. So how can we fix this? Actually, it's very, very simple. One function will solve this is by using the trim function. So here in the send button at event listener, once we get the message using the text box dot value, we can immediately use dot trim. And this is going to remove any space at the beginning or at the end. Now, if I save and refresh, if I add here, if I type how are you again and add lots of spaces and then send, now it's going to recognize this message and it's going to respond with the correct answer, I am great. Because the spaces at the end have been removed using the trim function. And of course you need to do that even if the user uses the uh, key press, the enter key or a keyboard uh, on their keyboard, you need here to type, you need here to use the dot trim and you are good to go. So again here if I type here lots of spaces and then the message that I want maybe how are you again how are you and if I send it's going to recognize it as a valid message and I'm going to get the correct answer and of course again the more you improve the user experience and the more you are responsive and the more your messages are correct the better your application will be and your customers will be happy.